Wind is, it's, woo. Welcome to the Philip Cockrum channel viewers. Please like, subscribe, share, and comment. It helps this channel grow and it helps me bring you these great videos that we all love. So today we've got a brand new nitro engine. This is a dynamite 0.28 cubic inch, 4.5 cc nitro engine with pull start. You can see the specs there, the RPM, the horsepower, and all that good stuff here. It's just a little short unboxing video because there's nothing really on YouTube dedicated to this. And um, I'm going to do another video where I kind of show the actual install, but uh, I've got the stuff here to go over it with you. So let's take a look and see what you get here. That's kind of it. There's nothing. There's no instructions or really anything on this. They really assume that you, you should know what you're doing, right? So I already cut apart the plastic to take a look at it. So there's our little motor there. You can see the pull start. So that's the exhaust port there. You can see the cylinder inside. I'll move the flywheel here a little bit. You can see it going up and down in there. That's a carburetor here. So that's the air inlet where the fuel filter is gonna go. There's our cylinder head and you can see it's got no plug in it. So it's really hard to focus down in there to really see the cylinder there, but it's in there. Um, so what's going to go in there is one of these little tiny glow plugs. If you're not familiar with this, you can see the coil there. And how it works is you put one of these igniters on it to get it going. You can see it light up there. And then once it's going, the fuel keeps it hot and running. You take the starter thing off and it'll run by itself. Hopefully it should be. So these need to be broken in. And um, uh, we're going to show you that. Um, I've got another video actually already prepared on another car showing a brand new nitro motor break in. And that's what that is for there. Um, you can also use a heat gun, but this is a little bit... Uh, uh, preferred method or a better method um, and then we've also got a new fuel filter there a couple of filters so you can kind of see what it looks like it's a little screen inside of this little tube kind of thing there um, and then uh, this one here actually goes down inside your tank right to screen the stuff going in there it's kind of important because it gets a little dirty uh, doing this kind of work so let me pull up the car that's there so you can see what this is going into and what we have to do to get this motor ready to run in that car. Okay, and here's our car. So this thing is huge. So here's a normal 10 scale car beside it, and this is an eight scale car. So this thing is like, you know, at least two feet long. Um, it's a pretty big car. You know, this downward uh, perspective doesn't really show you the true scale of this thing, but it's, it's a monster. It's pretty big. Um, so, um, there's our old motor and stuff like that. So let me zoom in here a little bit. We'll give you a quick rundown of the car. So there's our engine, of course. We've got our air filter and a carburetor here, fuel tank and stuff. So you get a little bit of pressure from the muffler and the exhaust system to push the, sorry, that the fuel line's not supposed to look like that. Um, and pushes into the, uh, some pressurized into the gas tank, which helps feed into the carburetor system here, which feeds into the motor. And, um, so just underneath right here where I'm pointing my finger is the flywheel, right? And the clutch where my finger is on and the gear. So we're going to need these pieces off this motor here. And we're going to be using the muffler and stuff too from this car. Um, other than that, uh, this is the brake here in the middle. So this servo here works the throttle on the carburetor and it also pushes a brake, so it's got a center brake on the drivetrain system like that. And then that servo up there is for the steering mechanism. Um, so that's about it. So we're gonna remove this engine, take these parts off it, get them all cleaned up, and then install them on the new engine, and then do the break-in of this car, and then get it driving around. So I'm pretty excited for that. That's our show for you today, folks. Love and peace from Canada. And we are YouTube.